anyways, good day to us once again. Today, we're going to the house of my friend. His name is Ismar Amilasan. He is doing a lot to support his family. And by way of supporting his family, he is actually breeding guppies, mollies, and goldfish. Because of his situation, he wasn't able really to breed a lot because his space is very small. They are actually informal settlers and their place is not theirs. They are actually temporarily residing in that place and he told me that the place is soon to be demolished to be used by the government. So we will visit his house and we're gonna extend some help. You know guys, yesterday in my previous videos, I've shared with you that I received an unexpected gift a japanese koi direct from a prestigious farm in japan and i can show you the birth certificates of this japanese koi this is the proof that the koi's that we have received just two days ago is actually coming from a legitimate koi farm in japan and i was so thankful to our donors we have lyle eric mahidlawan thank you so much by way also of reciprocating god's goodness we will also help other people i know i like this man because though he is living literally in poverty but he's doing a lot he sells fishes at the school so we will go there So if you can see over there, this is the place of our friend and we cannot proceed using this motorcycle because it's so muddy. I'm sure that we're gonna stop on this mud so we will walk maybe 100 meters from here. And if you notice that this road is under construction and it will pass through the place where our friend built his house. <laughs> we are here now at the house of Ismar and he's the one that I've been telling you 20 years ago when I started breeding these ornamental fishes Ismar has been my supplier of Dapnya he was just a little boy and he's been supplying me of this uh, Dapnya in exchange for a fish so now he's already married and he has uh, two lovely kids and you look at his place he really wanted to expand the breeding but the places were just so small they are actually informal settlers in this area and the bad news is that this area is also going to be demolished by the government for road construction that is why the problem now is lies in the hands of this young father who really wanted to uphold the needs of the family through breeding ornamental fishes. He's been into public schools just selling fish and he's really earning an income out of this business. And he wanted to construct a new pond but he cannot because of capital. Can we have a short interview with Ismar? Ako pala si Ismar Amilasan. 
Ako yung dati na maliit pa, nagsusupply kay Boss Dexter. Hanggang ngayon, hmm. nandito na ako at dalawa ng anak ko sa isda lang. Ang anak buhay ko, anak isda lang talaga, wala nang iba. Dati ako nag-drive ng motorbike, pwede ka, contraction, pero kulang talaga. Kaya dito ako nag-focus ngayon sa isda kasi marami, marami akong makuha na experience dito. Habis mo na, hmm. tapos kikita ka pa. Minsan, nagsisetline din ako ng dapya, kumukuha ako, kung may tawag sa akin, nagbibenta ako ng dapya. Kahit madumi, pera, basta hanap buhay na ano, marangya. Kahit ano papasokin ko, basta malinis. Hindi sa masamang kung saan saan galing mga paraan ng pera. At least, mm -hmm. ano ko talaga, dugo at pawis ko talaga yung pinangbubuhay ko sa mga anak. We will check also his guppies inside. Hello. Uh, my baby. If really he has only a good place, this man could have expanded his talent and breeding, but it's precluded due to some constraints like this uh, place very small place but he is earning an income out of this that's why I really admire this man because despite of hardship in life he really was able to find means to earn an income not depending on someone else but only depending on his talent and and skill as a breeder That's why I said that we don't get tired of helping people, especially those people who cannot pay us back. And this is my principle in life and I just proved that it's not actually when you give, you lose. It's actually when you give, you are gaining. Maybe not from the recipient of your gift or your presence, but God will use other people to pay you back. And when God pays, it is sure that He pays a hundredfold much, much more than you have given. Uh, ito pa lang Seven Swords na una kong isda, pinakamamahal ko isda. Pirigalo ko to kay Boss Dexter. Kasi sa pagtulong niya sa akin. Kaya ngayon, nakilala kami dalawa. Saka huwag niyong kalimutan mag-subscribe sa Dexter Woods. Para marami pa tayong matulungan ng ibang tao. Ibang salamat. He gave us this one. This is not an ordinary sword tail because it has seven swords. Aside from they have bright colors, their fins really are very beautiful. There are seven fins. That's why we call this seven sword. So guys, that is our, you know, engagement with Ismar. Kapasalamat pala ako kay Bossing Lexter kasi kung hindi din dahil sa kanya, wala din ako. Wala din yung bumibili sa akin. Buti nagkilala kami dalawa, tinulungan niya ako kung paano. Paano ganito mag-bid, paano ganyan. Kaya yun, marami akong techniques isda ngayon at techniques sa pag ng mga ano-anong klaseng isda. Dahil sa tulong ni Boss Dexter. Siya talaga ang nagano sa akin. Kaya ngayon, hanggang ngayon, nandito pa rin ako. We're just doing this thing, this video, to encourage everyone that no matter how difficult life may be, if you are just willing to stand and find your way to earn a living, you can do it despite of the obstacles, despite of the hardship, the poverty in life. You have to think positive and discover your talent to be able to live a better and happy life. Thank you for watching and we ask you to please continue on watching our channel so that we can also extend help to other people. Your view, your share, and even comments on this channel will help us a lot to further our cause, to further our desire to help other people. So thank you and please don't forget to subscribe only here at Dexter's World.